Next weekend, Chorus Abilene will be crowning the next Abilene Idol at the Paramount Theater on that stage, and you are invited to see that particular show. So here with us now is Monique Speckles and Savannah Riddell with uh, Will Hare, Will Chair. Sorry about that. With Abilene Idol, welcome today. So. Ladies, who's who's ready to sing out loud? And who's ready to make some great money for Chorus Abilene? Oh yeah, We're I'm ready. ready to hear all of our amazing finalists coming up. So it's going to be good. It's going to be a good show. So we've already had the auditions. Those were held at the at the um, Mall of Abilene mm -hmm. in the Dealers Courtyard, and you guys. I'm so glad I didn't have the job to narrow down the finalists <laughs> because was hard. amazing talent. Well, we've we've heard just tremendous voices coming out of this particular uh, performance in this competition, mm -hmm. and so you'll narrow it down: children and adults. Yes. Uh -huh. And you're one of the finalists. Yes, I am. <laughs> okay, so tell us about this whole experience. What was it like singing in Dillard's and then going to the Paramount stage? Are you naturally a performer? Is, is the stage your home? Well, I've, I've been performing since I was three, um, which, so it, it's a pretty good place for me to be, but it's still nerve wracking. It doesn't ever get any easier. <laughs> so I was definitely scared, but um, they make it so easy because they're all so sweet and welcoming. So it's been a fun experience. And have you have you heard any of your comp your competition and what they're singing or how? They're I have, and okay. they're all so amazing. <laughs> so I'm really excited to hear them and see them all on the big stage. But clearly, you yourself are incredibly talented, and that's oh. why you're here today. Oh, she really you. is. <laughs> she does um, some of our community events, the photography and things like that. And she came to audition. I did not even know that she could <laughs> sing, and it just blew me away. So she was definitely an asset to our family. So this is your first time, Savannah, performing with Abilene Idol? Yes, it is. Okay, you just decided to take a leap and just jump off and go in feet first. I've wanted to do it for years. We moved here in 2019, and every year I've seen it, I've always chickened out. But this year I finally just went ahead and did it. I was like, there's no reason not to. This so. when you are spreading your wings and you're going to soar yes. to success. <laughs> <laughs> and Monique, all of this, all of this b benefits Chorus Abilene. So this is actually providing scholarships for young budding artists as well. Yeah, so um, Chorus Abilene, we have four different ensembles and Abilene Idol is our major fundraiser and it helps provide scholarships, tuition, music programming and events um, for us to perform at throughout the community. So it really just helps us year round. Well, we say throughout the community, I mean, mm -hmm. but Course Abilene, I mean, you, you all, when I say you've gone on the road, I mean, you've traveled. I mean, you all have been all over the nation and, and yes. done performances everywhere. So this is mm -hmm. really giving local entities, local talent like Savannah, <laughs> the opportunity to showcase their talent and yes. continue to embrace it and mm -hmm. pursue it if they care to do so or if it's just an outlet and it's just a, a fun way for them to utilize it locally, they can mm -hmm. do that as well. But oh, yes. the rest of us just reap all the benefits and all the rewards <laughs> getting to hear these beautiful <laughs> yes, voices. We do. That's why I didn't audition, I promise you. Nobody, <laughs> we, we, there's no rewards what I'm singing, I promise. <laughs> What's been the most fun about the entire event and the whole process? Honestly, the anticipation is really fun. And I haven't, since I graduated last year from Murray, I was a theater student. I haven't done much performing. So I've been wanting to find a way to do that again because I love doing it so much. And this has given me an opportunity to kind of have something to look forward to and perform again. So it's really exciting. But this time you're taking the role as yourself. Yes. <laughs> I don't have to act as anybody, so that's fun. It's all you. <laughs> yes. Okay, and you're going to be singing something similar, a same piece, or something different for the finale? Uh, we're singing the same song that we auditioned with. So I'll be singing Don't Rain on My Parade from Funny Girl because I love Barbara Streisand, and I just had to. I had to pick that one. <laughs> all right, Monique, th this entire process from the kiddos to the adult singing, what's your favorite part of it? Uh, my favorite part. <laughs> Can you narrow that down? It's yeah. going to be hard, but I'm going to say the community. Um, I auditioned in 2012 when Abilene Idol first had our first season, and I've built so many friendships from that point on to now, and I really hope that our contestants have the same and just build friendships and network and just build memories. Well, speaking yeah. of community, we want the community to come out and support these, yes. these young and beautiful artists and their voices and support Chorus Abilene. So everyone is welcome to get their tickets and come and watch yes. the final finale and find out who's going to be crowned the winner. Oh, yeah. And the oh. fun thing is that in the audience, you get a text vote for your favorite finalist. All right. Audience so, participation. Yeah. We love that. Oh, yeah. You're not just a pretty face sitting in the audience. You're actually making and changing the lives of these performers. Mm -hmm. Well, Absolutely. congratulations. And best of luck to you. Thank and you. Uh, always a congratulations for Chorus Abilene. Thank you so much. For the rest, we would love for you to come out to to the Abilene Idol finale that will be at the Paramount Theater located at 352 Cypress Street Friday, February the 24th. That's a week from tomorrow, 7 p.m. Tickets are $15 for general admission, 12 for students, seniors, and military. We have the links where you can get those tickets and vote for your favorites. That's on our website, bigcountryhomepage.com.